Welcome back, grade three. Last class, we learned how to use the vanishing point and the parallel lines to draw these three-dimensional buildings with a bird's eye view. Well done. And today, we are going to work on the details on each building. And we are going to start off with this building right here. Line up the ruler and draw parallel lines along the edge of the building. And that will be the floors of the building. These lines must get closer and closer together as they reach the bottom of the building. Do you see the difference of the size here? It's because what we are doing right now is a bird's eye view drawing. So the higher floors look bigger and it gets smaller, smaller, and a way to smaller as it goes down to the ground floor. And that's the way the birds look at things from the sky, right? So again, it looks bigger on the higher floors and gradually it will get smaller, 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 and eventually it looks nearly disappeared on the ground floor. And same thing for this round building. Now for this building, I want to draw vertical lines for design instead of the floors. In that case, you need to use a vanishing point to draw them. So each vertical line needs to get an angle towards the vanishing point. And that's about it, boys and girls. I want you to use your creative brain to think about some special design or function for each of your building and your city. Have fun! Mm -hmm.